Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's jump right into it. In today's video you will find out how the price of IOTA has changed and what the technical indicators SMA, RSI, Divergence and Stochastic RSI are showing. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. Taking a look at the hourly time frame for IOTA, it can be seen that the price went down with around 3.0% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 32.7 cents. And the move wasn't very strong as the volume wasn't very high. Looking at the hourly simple moving averages, at the moment, the price is between the 200 and the 100 SMA. If the price bounces off the 200 SMA which is currently at 31.4 cents it could be seen as a support and the 100 SMA that is at 33.2 cents could be perceived as a resistance to the upside. If there were to be a break either way, it means that there could be a continuous move in that direction. Moving to the hourly relative strength index, the current hourly RSI is at 43, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. Jumping to the hourly stochastic RSI, we can see that the crypto is being oversold because the percent %K and percent %D lines are in the lower region. A change in the trend can be expected or for the crypto to remain at least stable for some time. You should wait to see if there will be an upward trend to the crypto because the K line has not yet crossed the D line. Jumping to the three hourly simple moving averages, at the moment, the price is between the 50 and the 20 SMA. If the price bounces off the 50 SMA which is currently at 32.2 cents it could be seen as a support and the 20 SMA that is at 33.3 cents could be perceived as a resistance to the upside. If there were to be a break either way, it means that there could be a continuous move in that direction. However, the shorter time frames are not very accurate and the bigger time intervals like the daily should also be considered for longer price development. Moving to the 3 hourly relative strength index, the current 3 hourly RSI is at 48, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. Looking for divergence in the 3 hourly time frame, owing to the bearish divergence, the price has already gone down. Jumping to the 3 hourly stochastic RSI, we can see that the crypto is being oversold because the percent %K and percent %D lines are in the lower region. A change in the trend can be expected or for the crypto to remain at least stable for some time. You should wait to see if there will be an upward trend to the crypto because the K line has not yet crossed the D line. Generally, the bigger time frames have a bigger impact on the price, so please keep that in mind when we show different time frames showing contrasting indicators. Also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short-term trading. Thanks for watching and know that every few hours new videos are uploaded analyzing different cryptocurrencies, so be sure to hit subscribe and not miss out. If you have any questions, leave a comment below and we'll get back to you ASAP. Also, keep in mind that you should make your own investment decisions as cryptocurrency trading is very risky and these daily videos are only an overview of trends and are a purely technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. See you next time.